I mean why shouldn't you? Yellen is a such a well balanced and fun 5 star, and that gives her so much replayability. I can tell you that if you build her properly, you will find yourself not wanting to ever switch her out of the team, unlike some other 5 stars. She can be used for just about everything, whether it's as a taxi for exploration, or a beast support in Spiral Abyss. People like to say that she's just a 5 star Shincho, when in reality, I think they both have their places and are most effective when used together. If you pull for Yellen, you will most likely be doing the Emblem of Severed Fate Low Maid, which is used for most other burst support characters such as Shincho, Beidou, Shangling, and even Raiden Shogun. Another reason for pulling Yellen is that she's really free to play friendly. The Favonius Warbo is the first F2P choice for her as you will be building energy recharge. Another thing is, the next weapon banner features not only Yellen's signature weapon, but also the Staff of Holma. What's more, Yellen is perfectly fine at C0. You don't need any constellations for her to be good. She is also a support character meaning you can switch in a lot of different team comps whether it be a Vipu Tao or a Hyper Bloom Raiden. Now let's actually talk about some reasons you may not want to pull for her. First of all, if you've been waiting for another character to rerun, don't get greedy and stay strong. Secondly, the boss that you will have to farm for Yellen is the Ruined Serpent. Yeah, that alone convinced me not to pull for her, cause f*** that. If you've made it this far, make sure to like the video and subscribe. Let me know in the comments if you will be pulling for Yellen. Thanks for watching.